you are watching Melody Lane with me you're gonna have a great crafting time Hi guys, it's Melody Lane. I'm finally going to plan in my planner. I made a lot of stickers and I'll be showing you how to make the stickers. There'll be some videos coming up. Let me know if there's something specific you want to see. I used the Cricut foil, these. And then I made some days of the week. I need to weed these a little bit more. These are for my show that I do with May May Made It, This Crafty Life Live. We do a live show every other week on Monday at noon Eastern time, and we have guests and chat and craft news and all kinds of things. And then I made some planner stickers. This is actually, I've never planned before. So you guys are seeing my first time ever. This book is empty. I've never done it before. I'm not sure what things I want. So I went ahead and did the normal thing of morning, afternoon, evening. We'll see how I like it. It may change. I know it will change. Over time, I made these on the Cricut Explorer. I will have a video on that also. And there's going to be a giveaway, like I said in this video. And most of my planner videos, I will try to do a giveaway. This giveaway is for Sweet Stamp Shop stamps. Your choice of stamps, you get a $20 gift card for Sweet Stamp Shop. She has awesome planner stamps. Look at this one. This is for the girls, not the guys. Because look at some of these. Totally going to be using this one today because I have an appointment to get my hair colored and to get my nails done because I really need my nails done. Look at my nail. And look at some of these. <laughs> these are for the women. And then here's some nice little words you can use. And I love that little art palette because I think I'm going to put that in my planner. That I need to just sit down and paint. Oh, and I like the check mark too. Oh, and the star, and the heart, and the box, and the balloon, and the camera. And then I showed you this one the other day, and I showed you this one too. Because this week, actually today, the day I'm recording, it's my mom's birthday, December 9th. So I thought I would put some balloons on there. And I like this one for painting too and coloring. Have you guys gotten into coloring? I have tons of coloring books and I haven't started yet. I keep saying I'm going to go on Periscope and color. If you want to follow me on Periscope, it's Melody Lane 815 Oh, and I want to use this one today too because my mom loves snowmen. So I thought I'd put a snowman for her day. And this one, look, so it says mom. I'm going to use mom. And it's mom's birthday. One of these have happy birthday on them. Happy birthday. I think there was another birthday one too. Oh yeah, this one, birthday wishes. So maybe I'll put that too. To win the $20 gift card from Sweet Stamp Shop, you have to keep watching. Okay, I'm kidding. But please keep watching and subscribe to my channel. She has tons more stamps too. I have tons more, and I'll show you in another video. Some of these may be retired, and some of them are not. I think this one's still in her store. And I wanted to use the snowflake on that one, too. Love snowflakes. And it's December, right? We haven't had any snow yet, though. Oh, and this one, I forgot. I want to use that one, too. So I'm going to use that one when I record my videos in my planner. And then I have a YouTube sticker I made. This one. I'm going to put that so when I edit, I think. Make sure you comment below, and you can comment anything. You can tell me what stamp set you want the most from Sweet Stamp Shop. You can tell me what video you want me to do next. You can even give me advice on my planner, because like I said, if you, there's a lot of people doing planner videos. This is my first time. What I think I'm going to do is put the stickers in. I cut this. I think it's Anna Griffin washi tape sheets. I needed a new blade in my Explore. I have not changed my blade in my Explore in months. So it wasn't cutting through all the way. I've been doing a lot of cutting. I thought this was cut all the way through, so I unloaded the mat, and then it wasn't. So I put it back in and cut it again. And when you do that, it does not get in the exact same spot because the mat is always not in the exact same spot. If you don't unload the mat and hit the go button, it'll cut right on top of where it did before. So let's just go ahead and take this off. So it might be slightly off in size, but that's really okay because of the other stickers that I made. I'm going to start in the bottom corner of each one and line it up there. So it'll go all the way to this side and on the bottom because I have more stickers to put on the top and sides. Then line it up on the bottom so it's straight. 
And then I'm going to follow, because this has a pattern on it, I'm going to follow the one below it to put below it here. And I'm not positive if I'm going to put these yet down here. So I'm just going to go over to the next one and put it in the next spot. Okay, I got all the washi down for the washi sheet. I'm going to put these down. This is to cover up this up here. Because I want to do a purple and silver theme in case you haven't noticed yet. So I made these in Design Space just to cover this up. So I'm going to put this... This is hard to do on camera. Line up that edge. There we go. I have to weed this out right here. I think upstairs they're recording the video for the mystery box. For the Cricut Mystery Box, you can go check that out at Crafts by Two, their YouTube channel, and CraftsbyTwo.com. They do awesome mystery box videos. Well, they do good videos all the time, but all their videos are so funny and informative. They're also going to be doing some planner videos coming up next month. So I'm really excited for their planner videos to see what guys do in their planners. I don't think they'll be using that stamp set I showed you earlier. Okay, I got my Monday out. Now let me show you how to put that on. Let me give you a hint of the mystery box. There's vinyl and transfer paper in it. Better transfer paper than this. It's actually clear transfer tape paper. Okay, so you take your transfer tape paper. You can also use contact paper in vinyl, but I found the contact paper doesn't stick to this foil as well. So I'm going to put this down here. Press that down. I don't want to pick up the tea from the Tuesday. What I should probably do is cut that off right there. I will, because I'm just going to mess up. There, I don't have to worry about it. I'm going to use my clear block from Sweet Stamp Shop that I use for my stamps and burnish that down. So what I did is I turned it over and then I'm peeling this back off of it like that. And I'm going to put that right up on top of here on top of the silver. And then we're going to push this down again and burnish it down. And then when you peel this back, make sure that the foil is stuck to this foil. So pull it back slowly and real flat. It's coming off great. But if it's not, if this was pulling up with it, just go back and stick it down again and try again. Sometimes you have to get it from a different angle. There. Isn't that cool? I love it. That is so cool. So excited. Okay, I'm going to do the rest of these, and then I'll come back. Okay, so now I got my Monday and Tuesday on, and then I realized the little Y on here comes down a little bit, So, and I'm putting these stickers over it, so I thought, oh, I better put these down first. Remember, this is my first time doing a planner. So I put these down. I didn't do it perfectly. So I'm going to put the rest of these stickers down before I put these down. So you don't have to do as much as I'm doing. You don't have to put these down. You don't have to cover those up. And you don't have to put any stickers on. You can just actually use it with a pen and plan. But this is the fun part. So I made these stickers all one sheet. So I didn't have to try to line them up. I thought... It's much easier not having to line them up. So I had those cut out. The hard part for me is lining things up. But you really just have to line up the top one. And I remember if I told you this, I used Cricut vinyl. This is Cricut printable vinyl. So it has to be printable 
vinyl. Some people use sticker paper from like Staples and different places, but I have a lot of Cricut printable vinyl because it goes on sale. And I am a craft hoarder. I have a Facebook group called Craft Hoarders. And I also started a Facebook group for you guys who want to follow me doing this planning. I wasn't going to start one, but I was asked to. And everybody joined in and says, yes, you have to start a Facebook group for planning. So they came up with the name. And it's Planning Happy with Melody Lane. Because I have a vlog channel where I haven't done anything with it in months but on my vlog channel I tried to inspire people to be happy and grateful and all of that okay let's do morning so this one because I want the Y on top it's a little bit more difficult so I'm gonna use the spatula and see if I can take the Y up if not the Y is just gonna be underneath it so I just have it bent up a little bit and then I'm gonna stick this morning underneath it know if that's going to be straight and it's not okay this putting stickers down is something I'm new to I don't use stickers in my crafting projects okay maybe I need my tweezers oh much easier So I use the same font and these stickers and these and my G comes down here and the Cricut just cut it out around it. Much easier with the tweezers. Okay, so I'm going to continue to put these on here. Let's use the tweezers. So much easier. I can line it up and see a lot easier. Yay, I'm so excited. The tweezers are working. Oops. Much easier and faster with tweezers. I like these are the quick, quick it. <laughs> these are the Cricut tweezers. These came with my gold kit, but you can get them in a kit or by themselves. Let's see if this will work better with the tweezers. Let's cut that part out. I think, I don't know if it's just that I can see much better. My fingers, my big fat fingers are not in the way. There we go. I did not put a thing here because I'm going to use some stamps here for my mom's birthday. Maybe some balloons or something. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put the rest of these stickers down with my tweezers. Then I will come back. Okay, I got all of these stickers put on that I'm going to use. I think on this one I did not get them all on perfect this is my first time planning you guys are seeing this from the very beginning I'm not a professional planner if you want a professional planner find a channel that is just all planning that's been doing it for a while I got a new piece of transfer tape and I'm gonna put it over that and burnish it down I'm gonna use my hand because the heat from your fingers if your hands are warm We'll make it stick better. And flip this over. And then pull that back. And whoops, I don't want that stuck. Put this on for Friday. Friday, Friday. Push that down. And then peel it back like that. There we go. All right, now let's work on the rest of it. I'm going to put the rest of this on and then I'll come back. I got all my weekdays in there love that foil I love it this is gonna be fun I don't know what I'm doing I do know I'm gonna put this on it because it's so pretty I got this at Joann's I think someone asked me that in the last video so have you guys subscribed to my channel yet or put in the comments a comment at all so you can win $20 gift card for sweet stamp shop so I'm just going to put it all the way down. I'm going to use my fuse tool at the bottom to rip it off so it's straight. We'll see. This is not normal washi tape. So it's not perfect, but it's okay because I'm going to go across the bottom too. This is really pretty. It's like sparkly. I don't know if you can tell, but it kind of reminds me of snow. That is so pretty. 
You guys cannot tell how pretty it is. It's much prettier than what you can see. I don't know, can you see that sparkle? It went too far down on my paper, so I'm just going to cut that off. And I'm going to start this at the edge here. Cut it off at this edge. So I made these little squares to fit behind the email. So I'm just going to stick that up here. So I check my email every day. Try to check my comments on YouTube. I haven't been responding to the comments on my planner videos because I'm going to pick a winner from the comments. I'm going to lift this up so I can see it better. There. So can you guys see? Isn't it cool? So excited. The little things in life get me excited. A circle. I think I can make these circles a little smaller too. So what I was saying is you guys leave a comment and I didn't want to like respond to everybody because I didn't want it to choose me as a winner. And a lot of people do their Sunday and Mondays differently. Like they just do it as one column because it's weekend and they can just play all weekend. It's not my weekend. My days are all the, the same except for on Saturday and Sunday, George and Ken are home. And once in a while we go to the movie or something shopping. I kind of work for you guys, especially my Patreon supporters. I work for you. So I have to answer your questions every day. So I have to check my email every day. I have to check Facebook every day. I spend a lot of time on Facebook answering questions, sharing the sales. I'm a huge enabler. Oh, I don't even have enough of these. I only have five. I'll have to make some more. I think I only cut a few out because I was testing them. And I'll have a video on making these yourself. You can make these and cut them out of any kind of vinyl or anything. You can't even use paper. You can cut these out in sticker paper, make them any color you want, or vinyl, which I like. You don't have to print it. Let me go ahead and do this. I posted a picture of these on Facebook and somebody says, I need those so I know when your show is. I'm like, oh my gosh, you do. So I think when I do the video of this, because I do a video on showing you how to upload the patterns and making your own stickers like this, that's coming soon, I will also give you a place to download this photo to make your own stickers. So you can upload this as a picture. You could just print it as a picture and cut it or anything like that. Upload it as a JPEG and cut it out or you can upload it as a pattern in Cricut Design Space and then also use it to cut out. You can put it in your own planner so you remember when the show is. We have a show on the 14th. Wow, that looks blank compared to this one, doesn't it? Oh wait, let me put this on because that looks really bad. You see this? This actually was just a scrap piece. leftover uh, and I was afraid of that you can like see that but I'm probably gonna cut something out in the silver foil to go over this like a nice cute saying or something I'm pretty prepared for the next show that I prepared last week but usually I'm preparing for the show on Sunday night so what I'm gonna do is I made three different sizes stickers smaller ones medium and then this is like a double one and then this one will take up the entire, the entire thing. So I'm probably not gonna use that one. And because the show is pretty much ready, I'm gonna go ahead and just use a small one. And I'm gonna put it for the evening for Sunday night. Oh, that's when it usually happens. Actually, I do like earlier also, but I have to double check everything here. Let's play around with the stamps. It's my mom's birthday. Happy birthday. Here's birthday wishes. Okay, I opened up all these stamps because I'm going to be using these. This is Colorbox Cat's Eyes Pigment Inks. 
and I put uh, duct tape around them to keep them together, especially when I moved. I haven't used these since I moved. These are like metallic. I think I'm going to use this one right here first. This is for when I record video, and I record a lot of video lately. I have recorded video, I think on Monday I did a lot of video actually. I think I did two videos, all for you guys, and I also did it for this, all for you guys. I haven't edited a lot, but I did record, so I'm going to put that here. I don't always record every day, but you guys are so eager for my planning videos. Okay, now the best way to clean your stamps is just to stamp it until it's empty. Rubbing it with baby wipes also works, but you should dab it and not rub it because rubbing it can make it go away. Do you know what I mean? I need to get my hair and nails done so badly. So we are going to do that. Oh, you know what? I could do them together. I think I'll put them next to each other. And that's like at 4 o'clock in the afternoon, so that's going to be the end of my afternoon. Hair and nails. Okay, now I'm going to use the silver for the snowman. It's going to be down here. Little snowman. Okay, I got a bigger block. Okay, I'm going to have the little snowman doing the, holding the balloons. These are huge balloons for that little snowman. But look how cute. Okay, now I'm going to use this one for the happy birthday. I have it upside down. Good thing I put ink on it and can read it. And I can't get it on the sheet. So something I'm going to show you now is how to take these out. Because I was doing it wrong. I think I was pulling this way. And if you pull it up this way, these little pages don't get bent. Okay? So take it here. Pull it up. But happy birthday. There. That one did it better. I pushed too hard on this one. Use the mom one. I'm going to put that right here. And I pushed too hard again. Let me just... There. That's better. I don't know why I keep pushing down so hard. Okay, now I'm going to test this out. I don't know that I can stamp up here. If that will rub off or if it will dry. So I'm testing that right there to see. It's not snowing, but... Oh, you know what I'm going to do? So I know that this crafty life over here is for tomorrow. I'm going to put a little tomorrow stamp. And I'm going to put tomorrow right there. So I know it's tomorrow. And did I show you guys this one? I like this stamp set too. I love the cupcake. Oh, I'm going to put cupcake down for last night. Because Crafts by Two went out to Best Buy last night and came back with Dunkin' Donuts. It wasn't a cupcake, but it was a sweet dessert. So I'm just going to put cupcake. <laughs> okay, and 
this <laughs> this is delivery. That could mean anything, I guess. And this is on a food one, so is that like when we get delivery of food? So it's like almost every day. And I got this new Sharpie set of pens from Joann's with my 60% off coupon. So I don't know what I'm gonna write in here. Oh, I need a sticker for me, my mommy. I do a collab with her and I have to record that on Friday after I get my hair done. And I'll be editing that video because I have to have some things done. Okay, I will be editing video. Need to take this out. Video tomorrow. I will try to edit two videos tomorrow on planning. I'll be recording Made by Mommy on the 11th, the craft challenge. It's with a bunch of YouTubers. So I'm pretty much gonna be recording all morning. We'll be doing some editing Saturday morning and Saturday afternoon. Okay, now I just figured out what I'm gonna use these for. So you guys, this is the beginning of planning. I don't want you guys to be intimidated that you can't do this because you can. Showing you how, you can just wing it. I think it says that on one of these stamp sets. So I'm gonna put this here because it's Saturday morning and I will release a video on Saturday morning. I can't just pick that up though, I need transfer tape. Okay, I'm gonna use transfer tape to do this. I did do a video on this, I recorded that already, but I will be releasing that soon. I'm gonna put this right on that silver sticker. I'm gonna fold it up so I can see it. Get it all on there. Press that down and then kind of just pull it back like this. There we go. Oh, I should have put the donut one there from last night instead of the cupcake. Okay, here I'm going to release video. I need to learn to print. I never print. I need to make a Made by Mommy sticker. So I'm just gonna do Made by Mommy challenge, edit, plan, videos. And I need my craft desk clean to record the Made by Mommy video. So here I'm going to do clean, desk. Actually, I'll probably be editing all the way up into here. Then I'll clean the desk. Then I'll get ready to go get my hair done. Oh, I have to get gas. My gas tank is empty. So I'm going to write get gas in here. So I know I have to do that on the way to get my hair done. Or I might not make it. Actually, I'll probably make it. I probably wouldn't make it back. I need a stamp that says get gas. Is there one? Here I'm recording planner videos. I've also been Instagramming all day. So maybe I should put an Instagram thing on here too. And it's not morning anymore. What time is it? It's 4.20 in the afternoon. I'm still thinking it's morning. I'm gonna put an Instagram here. And it's Melody Lane 815 on Twitter and Facebook and everywhere else, Periscope. You guys have been going oh crazy over the little videos I've put on Instagram and Facebook and Twitter. I just did little videos of the stuff cutting out. Whoops. Don't want to pull that off. You know what else I need to plan that I don't do enough? Lots of things. But you know what I'm talking about? I need to clean my computer desk. I think I will do that on Sunday morning. Clean computer. Oh, I have a sticker of a computer. I'll put that on here too. I don't have a cutout, I have it in design space. I'm not cleaning my computer desk, I'm cleaning my computer desktop because there's way too many pictures on there. I need to clean it up so my computer runs better. Okay, let's color this in for now. I'm gonna use these colored pencils. I think I got my AC Moore. a purple and a pink and stew. I 
Okay, I'm going to use this set for the check mark. So I can check mark off the things I've done. Actually, I'm still recording, but I'm going to check one off because I've done some. I need to edit some too. Okay, there's a pee and a poop in here. I'm guessing this is for baby, like to keep a baby book. That'd be great. Because I'm not going to put every time I pee and poop in my book. Although you can. Maybe you need to keep track of that. Okay, I think I need this one that says stay focused. I think I might need that one every day. What do you guys think? So this first planner video is hours and hours and hours of editing. Because it's taken me so long. need it here. I'm not kidding. I really need it on Saturday. Okay, I took a little break. I was getting exhausted. This planning is taking much longer than I thought it would. So I'm going to be much busier. That means it's going to fill up my planner. So we know these days are gone now. This was the day I started this video on and now it's this day. I'm supposed to be editing this video that you're watching right now, but I'm not. I took a break. I was looking at some planners on Facebook last night and they made me not like mine. So I was like, oh. but this is my first one. So they will be different. I'm going to try to make each one different. I'm not doing the same thing. I'm not doing the same stickers for each week. I will show you how I made these stickers and these stickers and the sticker over here. This morning I added, I made those and added those stickers that I was missing. I also added this computer sticker because I need to clean my computer, my laptop computer. It is so full of screenshots and images. It's crazy. So I need to start cleaning that at least once a month, maybe twice a month. And I know I'll do it because it's in here. And I also added this. This is a Cricut image, the silver there. That's, I forgot what cartridge it's, I think wall decor or something like that is where it's from. It says Live Love Craft. I thought that would be pretty to go there. I love this washi tape. This is washi tape. And then this is the Cricut foil. But I made some new stickers today. Little Cricut bug and Patreon stickers. I need these so I know, remind myself when to release to the Patreon supporters. Because I try to release my videos to them one day earlier than I do my rest of my other videos. So I'm going to go ahead and put this here. And then I also made this little cricket bug. Isn't he the cutest? I just downloaded him from the internet, uploaded him to Design Space and cleaned him up. So I have to put him in here. I'm going to put him in pretty much every Wednesday at least. Every Wednesday is a new free cut of the week and the mystery box was released. So I'm going to put this here. He is so cute. Isn't it so cute? I'm going to put this in just because it's funny. It makes me laugh. And I think I want to, first I was going to put it here, then I think I want to put it here just to take up some of the space and I can always add something else down here too. Okay and I'm gonna use this paper that I haven't used. This is actually Cricut vinyl. It's Cricut printable vinyl. So I'm just gonna stamp this on here and use that so it's not wasted. Granny panties. This says you say granny panties like it's a bad thing. I just think it's funny. I love the glasses. So we are going to do that. Purple panties on. This really has nothing to do with planning. Don't think this is the day I change my underwear. I do that every day. I just think it's cute and funny. Makes you laugh. There we go. <laughs> How can that not 
make you laugh. I'm gonna have glasses on my granny panties. It's funny. <laughs> okay, comment below and let me know if you're laughing or not. And hey, that gets you an entry to the giveaway for $20 at Sweet Steam Shop. Okay, actually, I'm gonna color this first. This is my Wink of Stella glitter purple pen. Oh, I was gonna put the glasses in silver. This pen is the exact same color as the ink. And what's funny is, my grandma had glasses like that. And she probably had underwear like that. That was back in the 70s. And I want glasses like that now. I think they're so cool. This is Wink of Stella. It adds a little glitter. I don't know if you can see it though. And the glitter pen added glitter. Actually, I think I'm gonna put this on here. So this is watercolor pencils, and it'll make this blend more. And add glitter. So this is the clear Wink of Stella. Here's a close-up of it. I don't know if you can see the glitter. Let's see it there. Uh, we need some glitter on the snowman too. Snowflakes. Okay, back to our granny panties. Okay, now I'm going to fussy cut this out. I think this I'm going to cut with no border just because it's easy to. I think I'll stick them there. I'm going to put this one on first. fun? It has to make you laugh, right? Okay, put it back in. And hey guys, I'm going to take recommendations for themes for my weeks. I have a few to th I think I want to do for December, but after that, if you have any ideas, let me know in the comments below. If you put a comment, you get entered into a drawing to win a $20 gift card to Sweet Stamp Shop. And I'm not saying I'm done with this. If I add more to it, I'll show you when I do the next week's. I'll show you this week's because I'm sure I'm going to add more or do something to it. If it snows this week, I'm adding snowflakes. I want to add more snowflakes. I did some here. But until it snows, I don't want to add any, but it might happen because it's December 10th and it hasn't snowed yet. So we'll see what happens. I'm sure I'll be adding more to it. All right, guys, thanks for watching. In the next few videos, I'll show you how to make the stickers. And then I have to do next week's plan. It's empty. All right, guys, I love you. I'll see you in the next video. And here's a shout out to a few of the people who support me on Patreon. 
Yeah, right there. It's patreon.com slash Melody Lane. Bye, guys. Carla Reynolds, Sheila Leary, Judy Seisman, Jane Teague, Allison Hayward, Bridgetta Dalberry, Janelle Wells, Ariana Temple, Veronica Cano Campos, Leslie Z, Grace Kearns, Tracy Common, Amelia Ratcliffe, Sharon Loans, Fran Camaro, Linda Landis, Nancy Caron, and Dee Jones. Thanks, guys. Oh, and I wanted, I think it's Anna Griffin washi sheets, washi, t washi, sh washi tape.